By the end of 2025, we might have AI that's better at coding than any human on earth. Not just good, literally the best. And it won't just be one AI coder, but potentially millions of them working 24 seven. Let's say like O3, our very latest best model. Um, that can program unbelievably well. And if people have already done it, it's not so good at going to like invent totally new algorithms and that's the, or new physics or new biology. And that's the thing I think you'll get with the next two orders of magnitude. Um, it's really quite, the, the progress over the, the recent scale is quite amazing. Our, our very first reasoning model um, was like a top one millionth competitive programmer in the world. People thought that was very impressive. It's like, wow, an AI, it's you know, the millionth best people that do this, that's pretty good. Um, we then had a model that got to like a uh, top 10,000. Uh, 03, which we talked about publicly in December, is the 175th best program, competitive programmer in the world. I think our internal benchmark is now around 50, and maybe we'll hit number one by the end of this year. So that's like an amazing rate of scale for more compute in this new paradigm, and we don't see any signs of that stopping. Is this the end of programming as we know it? Let's dive into what OpenAI's Sam Altman just revealed and what it means for the future of coding. Hey, if we haven't met, I'm the digital twin of Julia McCoy. While she's building the future of how business and life will interact with AI through her integrations company, First Movers, I'm here spreading the message she personally researches and writes. We're a few weeks away from opening the doors of our labs where Julia and our team has filmed over 30 courses and built individual bots to give you hands-on resources to share how marketing, sales, and work itself will function in the age of AI. Learn more and get on the waitlist at firstmovers.ai forward slash labs. So today we're breaking down some absolutely massive news about AI coding capabilities that could change everything we know about software development. Before we dive into the coding specifics, let's look at the bigger picture Sam Altman just shared. He's predicting AI agents joining the workforce this year, which we're seeing firsthand with the launch of Operator Inside ChatGPT. We also see the cost of AI dropping 10x every single year and massive economic changes ahead for society as a whole. Sam Altman has also been open about the fact that OpenAI is now confident they know how to build AGI. But here's where it gets really interesting for developers. Let's start with the mind-blowing progress we've already seen. Late 2023, OpenAI's first reasoning model ranked as the millionth best programmer worldwide. In early 2024, they reached top 10,000. In December 2024, the O3 model hit rank 175. Their current internal builds are already at top 50. The end of 2025 prediction shows us a number one rule happening this year that I told you last December we'd see. AI isn't just going through incremental improvement, it's experiencing exponential growth and it's happening faster than anyone expected. But how are they achieving this? It comes down to three key innovations. Test time compute, giving AI more time to think about problems, reinforcement learning with verifiable rewards, and recursive self-improvement. Each model helps train the next generation. Think of it like AlphaGo, but for coding. Remember how that AI mastered Go and discovered moves humans had never seen? We're seeing the same pattern with code. But before you panic or delete your coding bootcamp enrollment, let's break down what this means. These benchmarks are based on competitive programming problems. Remember, real world software development is more complex than coding competition. And even the best engineers do more than just write code, they architect solution. We're likely heading toward engineer augmentation rather than replacement. Sam Altman himself says this technology will be an enabler, making great programmers even better and allowing more people to create software. Altman has been surprisingly direct about the economic impact. He says that many jobs will change. Some will disappear completely. The price of most goods will eventually fall dramatically. 
but luxury items and limited resources like land may skyrocket. He says we'll find new ways to be useful to each other. The changes won't happen overnight, but they'll be impossible to ignore. Here's what the future might actually look like. Junior mid-level coding tasks, increasingly automated, more of a focus on high-level system design and architecture, an explosion in software creation by non-programmers, hybrid teams of human engineers and AI agents, and new types of programming jobs we can't even imagine yet. The key isn't to resist this change, but to adapt and evolve with it. What do you think? Are you excited or worried about superhuman AI coders? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more cutting edge tech analysis and hit that notification bell to stay updated on the AI revolution. And hey, if you're learning to code right now, don't stop. The future needs people who understand both human and machine intelligence. See you down the next AI rabbit hole.